Hello guys and welcome. My name's NG Paradox and I would just like to apologize for the last video as you guys would have seen in the last video. The microphone I was using for some reason did not record what I said so I had to re-record what I said in the last video. So that does mean some things might have been out of place or out of time because for some reason when I watch a video and I record to it it seems to misplace the time. I have no idea why. It's a very odd thing. But I do apologize, but there's nothing I could do about that. It was just one of those perfect storm scenarios where everything just got effed up. Recently, I've had a lot of problems with recording recently for some reason. But hopefully we can get things back on track. Hopefully it wasn't too much of a bother for you guys. Just one part out of, you know, so many. So many. And what was that? Lord Robert of Dragonstone died. Ah, so the husband of Lady Shireen has died. She's not had a good time. She's definitely not had a good time. Her father died, her husbands have died, she's in jail. It, it's not been good. And Tyne Sand has been defeated. Kind of sad, I was hoping she could do a bit more damage. She didn't do as much damage as I hoped she could do. Uh, Edma Tully has died, and his daughter, Sabifa, who's Leaf. Look at those stats, that's not too bad. She's pretty good. And she's married to a Frey, who's a skilled fighter and left-handed. Okay. Uh, no children yet, though. She's only 25. But her daughter has... Her sister, sorry, has a normal marriage to a Pain, who's an idiot. So that means the Pains would inherit the Riverlands. And they already got the Westerlands there. So that would be really good for the Pains. The Pains could actually gain a lot from these events so far. The Swift Fish. Okay. Um, sounds like an odd name. Oh, 100%. Hmm. Now, obviously... um. What we've got here, obviously, uh, the Regent. Now, he obviously is part of my faction, so I could fire it, and I'm not sure if he accepts it or not. I think it's only if he's the leader of the faction he will accept it. So I'm not exactly sure how it will go this way. We are at 100%. If we can get one more man, I think, to join us, it'll be perfect. I, I don't want to risk it right now. But yeah, we've also got a chance, obviously, to get the Regency. Which would be nice. Not enough yet, but maybe in the future we can try and get the Regency. We can shut the gates. Um, I think we'll be fine. Bloody Flux. I feel like Dawn has been getting a ridiculous amount of sickness recently. Um, Treasurer. Well, I guess we could choose my daughter. She's really good at fighting. She's pretty good at fighting, but she's better than everyone else when it comes to being the Treasurer. So we'll make her my daughter the Treasurer. Ah, oh, look at her. Elia Dane. I think she's a worthy inheritor to the Tomantine. My other son, though, oh, he's great. He just, you just, you're just like your brother, aren't you? Franklin, if only you could get a skilled fighter, I'd be extremely happy. Skilled fighter and huge, he could take on many people. He could show people a thing or two. My beloved daughter's concerned she's not married. Okay, well, we need to find my daughter a marriage. If we're going to try and go for Dawn... We might want to get some people outside for some alliances. Uh, sorry, alliances when we take Dawn. Now, I'm trying to look if there's any boys she could marry. She could marry the brother. Uh, six years. You have to wait a bit of time for him, though. Maybe a bit too long. Uh, Boromund. Your son's. I had to be matrilineal, so that makes it even more difficult. He's a four year old slow son. That's not good. The prince there. We've got the pains. Um, the only boy is this one. He's already married, of course. He has a younger son. 13. Tyron Payne. Then we have that idiot one. This could be... I, I don't think they'd accept, because he's quite close in the inheritance. Yeah, they're not going to accept that one. Okay, it was a shot. We might as well try. Um, we've got, obviously... Asher Greyjoy, the Kraken's daughter, as Queen of the Ironborn. What a lovely way for things to go. Poor Theon. Put in jail. We could try and marry him, maybe. I, again, I don't think they'd accept. Yeah, no. Two in the line of succession. How about the brother, then? He's a craven. We need to find us someone who fits her very well. Her son, the Malister. Passive, quick, attractive... Bastard. What a weird mixture of things for him to have. He's a hunchback. No, I don't like this. 
Yeah, no boys there to marry. Obviously, we've got Brian. Ooh, we could marry the second boy, the immaculate and giant, but we have to wait a few years, but I think he might be worth it. But yeah, he's too high in the line of succession. The other one, though, is quick. We have to wait 10 years. She'd be like 29. I don't want to wait that long for her. And the North. Sansa, of course. Yep, yeah, all of them. I don't think there's any particularly good ones up north. Okay, let's look in our own lands then. Let's look for one of the vassals. Now, one of the best vassals is obviously the Ullas. But there's no boys to marry there at all. Okay, the Yonwoods. She's a son. And a grandson who's an idiot. And believes in Roller. And nothing else. Well, that's not great choices. Man, Woody. You know, we have gotten a lot. We, you're helping us in our faction. And we could, if we... Hmm, we could try and get them the prince's pass, possibly. Ooh, this one's giant. This one's a giant as well. That could be good. I think that could work out. Five years. No. Too high in the line of succession? Cognatic. No. He's like four down. That doesn't seem right to me. Huh. I thought that would be okay. I would have thought they would have accepted that, but apparently not. Okay, let's look at the other most powerful lords in Dawn. Who do we have? We have them, us, um, the Stoneway. Oh, let's kind of move this. There we go. I'm in a planky town. You have a son. Nine years old. He's an idiot. That one has some bad stuff going on. We have the Fowlers. The Fowlers seem to just be crazy at the moment. Uh, the Illyrians. Daughters, daughters, daughters everywhere. Wow. That, I, I can't believe they wouldn't accept. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised. Huh. Uh, Jordan here. Uh, nothing there apart from him. I don't think they'll let us marry him. No. I should try and get a favor then with Manwoody. That might be the way to do it. If we can get a favor from him, could possibly do it. The other son's married. He's married. The daughter. She has other sons. Okay. This one's strong, but also slow. Ugh. Very bad choices here for my, my daughter. Yeah. There's no good choices at all. Okay, yeah, I don't like any of them. I might have to try and get a favor from Manwoody. I'd like to marry to him. Send a gift by favor to get a favor from 80 gold. Base reluctance. Hmm. Okay, we'll leave it then. I'll have to leave. I'm sorry, daughter. I'm going to have to leave it for now. Your marriage will come later. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Why, Castos? Why? Why have you done this to me? Ugh. Why has he done this to me? I can't believe he turned out to be a craven. And the king has taken his last breath. Suspicious circumstances. So the, the kingdom is turning into disarray recently. It's absolutely just ridiculous the amount of scheming and backstabbing going on for the Iron Throne still. It's like there's no open wars, but it's just like open scheming and kind of small battles. We now have his son, though. King Lorien... Lannister. He's only good at intrigue, really. Um, he's lustful, just, craven, ruthless, though, and fashionable. Trained fighter, not married. His other brother is slow. I've been reading the Seven Points of Stand. It claims that death is not something a true believer should be afraid of. I do not fear death. I am of the night. I am death. I should probably... i got a bit of diseases there. i got a bit of diseases there. I should probably seek treatment. Ooh, 46%. Oh, we're actually very close. Okay, how much would you cost? 18, I can afford that. Okay, we'll pay that. We'll get treatment done. And faction, 91%. Yeah, Manwoody's still there. Ooh, Manwoody was given the High Lord of Prince's Pass. That is what I wanted, and he has the bloody flux at the moment. Though his heir is Dickon... Man, would he? He's changed it to seniority. Why would he do that? His daughter was married matrilineally to Seaworth. Why would he change it? Huh. Okay, well, that means the marriage of them seems a bit silly. 
Um, holding a coronation. Yeah, we'll attend. It's a big event. Uh, curse his name, though. Mr. Wiles comes to you and offers treatment for your illness. Well, because I'm kind of cynical, I don't always trust people. I think we'll just go for the normal one. You just make sure he knows what he's doing. Just, just do what you're meant to do. Don't do any fancy, silly, or stupid things. Just do what you're meant to do, sir. Master Whale, uh, Mace, why say Master? Master Whale told you to undress and then kneel with your buttocks raised. That was awkward enough, but when you saw the instrument in his hands, you almost bolted. Wile must have noticed because he patted you calmly on the shoulder and told you to stop clenching. I actually feel bad. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Interesting, that one. Okay, so we got some some treatment there. Now, you're going to give us 50%. There we go. Luton Cologne, Liberation of Winterfell. Huh. So some people of Winterfell are not happy with what's going on. Oh, ended inconclusively. Does this series really convince me? What, benevolent and peaceful rule of the princes? Yes, yes, yes. Um, what was I doing? Oh, yes, I was looking at the intrigue. But we can't do these still, because we're ill. So we have to get rid of this gonorrhea. Okay, the world's a dangerous place, and people are trying to kill me. What? Who the hell is trying to kill me? I am of the night. Oh. 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 Lady Jalita Sand. That is not good. This is not good. The wife to the Swigert. So she's off in the Stormlands. And Joffrey Drinkwater. Ah, the Sand of Tain Sand. Maybe he knew what I'd been scheming. Why would he want to try and kill me? I think he knows I'm trying to put my wife onto the p position of Dawn. So I need to get rid of my sickness. So I need to get some more support, really. It's one of these two things. I've watched from the shadows as my spy master, Master Clarence, Siratipis... Siratipis... Marked a spot on the wall with a piece of chalk. This might just be his normal skulldiggery, but my intuition says not. Time to spy on the spot. Of course. He does like me. We have to be careful. People are trying to kill me. And what is this? You want Franklin to go be trained by Aaron Caleron? No. The king on the Iron Throne, in the name of the father, I, Lorien of the House Lannister, pledge to look after the realm. Of course you do. Man, would he still in charge? Ugh, we need him to stay alive. Really, bloody flux is not good for us. Or I need to get this. So I need to not be ill. Then again, if he dies, maybe I might be named Regent? Possibly? Maybe? My lord received a decree from, King's, from King Lorien in King's Landon. The king has signed a law granting extensive powers and new freedoms to the faith and the high septon. According to the reports, this was done in exchange for cancelling the Iron Throne's debts to the faith. Well, there we go. A Lannister once again underestimating the faith. I mean, he's 18. Maybe he doesn't know any better. But still, another Lannister doing this. Why? Why Lannisters? Why? 87%. Unlanded Sun. Okay, Intricate Web Weaver. He's still got Craven though. If he just didn't have that Craven, he'd have 9 Marshall. That's it, really. Dual skill modifier minus 2, yeah. Oh, you could have been okay, Cass. You could have been an okay man. You know, 9 Diplomacy, 9 Marshall, 10 Intrigue. You could have been okay, but instead, you've turned into a disappointment. Your sister's much. Why can't you be like your sister? Or even your brother. Look, he's patient and stubborn. And it looks as though I'm getting worse. I've now got chest pains. My maester. Maester, help me. He's killed your son, Franklin. No. Don't you dare. Don't you peep. Why is everyone trying to kill me and my son? No. Seek, I can't seek treatment right now. I guess because I am I already had treatment before. Uh, Catherine Trent was beheaded on the orders of the king. And now I'm also getting a fever. <laughs> that guy was just killed. I'm now getting more people wanting the regency. But I'm always going to be ill. I can't do anything. I guess that makes sense. You know, if you're ill, you can't really look after the realm, can you? We need someone else to join. 
I'm gonna have to send my spy master to do that. Get someone to join the faction. Hellholt. If you can get Hellholt to join, we will be set. We would be set. But no, you're thrown between waves of chills and sweat. We've got the bloody flux. No, the bloody flux has got to me. No, this can't be. I can't end like this. We're so close. We can't have it end like this. Can't declare. I don't have the money to hire men as well. To really push for it. 94%. Come on. One person, join me. Or just go up to 100%. Something. Someone, save us. 95%. 64, so a quick look if anyone would now join if I paid them. No. I mean, it won't help, is it? Why am I looking at it? It won't help me anyway. Uh, your son Frank's running very well to my tuition. He's getting two diplomacy. Well, his diplomacy, he's getting quite good at diplomacy, actually, Mr. Franklin. Well, that's good. My daughter's good at fighting. My second son is a bit of intrigue. And a third son is a good diplomat. You know what? Maybe, maybe they're not too bad, my kids. Maybe they didn't turn out as bad as I thought they did. 97%. It's going up, but I'm running out of time. We're running out of time. We can only last for so long. I'm already extremely old. Please don't, don't you dare, Gerald. I said I would get you it. And Lord Paramount Harold the Wild Falcon as you usurped the title of the kingdom of the veil. So there we go. So Harold the Wild Fan Falcon. Yeah. He's taken over. His wife is a lowborn girl. He has a son who has Gulltown apparently. The city of Gulltown. Master Alistair Aaron. So his son is an Aaron. His one didn't change to Aaron. But all his children did. Yeah. Interesting. That they take on the thing but he didn't. That's kind of weird. Um, but yeah, the fact he's got that now is going to be big. There could still be turbulence. You know, Robert Aaron still did have other kids. And the child is still alive, the former one. 98% for some time being the employee of Lord Damon. You got good stewardship. You know what? Do it. You got good stewardship. We need a man like you right now. Okay, Eric. There we go. Give me that money. Give me that money. There we go. That's not too bad a council. He's a septon though, so I can't get him married. Westerosi Valerian Liberation Revolt. Oh. So Shireen, her husband, has done... His name's Aegon, interestingly. He's doing a Westerosi Liberation Revolt. What a weird situation that is. He's got 20,000 men, actually. What's the war for? He wants Dragonstone. He wants to make Dragonstone free back to Valerian. This is very odd. But it's 100% victory already. <laughs> now that war did not last long. 101%. This might be the only chance I have. Maybe we just have to take it. I do have the regent on my side. So it does give us a little advantage there. He has the bloody flux. Arm and the Delicate Spear would inherit. He's also got flu. Everyone has the bloody flux. That bloody flux. Can't seek treatment. I might just have to click it. Is it still going up? It's going up at once. It's going up 0.1 like every minute. Okay, went down. This might be the only time. This might be our only chance, man Woody. Maybe we just have to go for it. Hmm. I think we're going to have to go for it. If I want to do it before Gerald dies, I have to put this into motion. But he might gain more men as well. So it's not completely in my hands. How much money could I get? 50 gold. That's not enough. It's not enough gold. It's not enough. I'm going to have to wait. I'm going to wait a bit more. A bit more power. Please. No, don't you dare go down. Oh, have gone back up. Okay, now it's gone back up again. More people making more factions. Crown loyalists there. At least Lady Bright. Ah, oh, this is so, so risky. 
I wish my son just got a skilled fighter, damn you. Lord Ramsay the Dreadfort, you set the title lordship of Weepin Bay from the Molland. Okay, who's your wife? Windy Grove. He has a son. Alaric Bolton, uh, ugly. Ugh, a line of Ramsay Boltons, ugh. Look at all this stuff. Lunatics, cruel, torturer, hunter, cannibal, ugly. Just so much. So much stuff there for him. These Paphews, I must have a higher purpose. You, what the? I just got you into my house. <laughs> we just bought him here. You cost me money. God, ugh. Didn't even repay me back. I think I have to just set it off, aren't we? I keep waiting. I keep waiting for an opportunity. Oh, oh, it's gone up even more. Is he full? Yeah, I'm not going to be not ill, am I? Yeah, because we got successfully treated. It's not going to go away. Lorch has taken over Ashmark. Laurent Lorch. All his kids are dead. Damon of Ash. Wow. Damon killed. All of his kids. That's uh, that's pretty bad. No wonder he took over. He's been through a lot. Prolific, robust voice. Okay. Where is Damon? Was Damon one? That, was Damon uh, the Marbrand? Yeah, yeah. Damon Marbrand the Wicked. He was the one who killed all of his kids. It might have been because of the war, but yeah, I can't imagine he's going to be good to him. That's, that's an interesting... That's an that's a very horrible situation to be in. I think I'm just going to set it off. Because so I think we have a chance because obviously the regent's on our side. And it is, you know, it's, it's going to be very close if we go to war though. As I'm beating a rabid dog in the yard, the little cure Darren up, runs up and starts hitting me with a stick. That son of a... I'll show that filthy tadpole. As I turned, the dog bit me in the ankle and Darren managed to get away. Curses. Why am I becoming rivals with these little kids? I'm an old man. I don't know what it is with Gerald. He just keeps making more rivals. Yeah, we're not going to get them to join us. It looks like it's just not going to happen. Okay. Let's do it. I'm going to do it before I die. Demand installation of my wife. Your Septon has fallen foul of the faith, it seems. As he's been called by the High Septon to King's Landing. Okay. Huh. <laughs> he's, he's a Septon himself. Um, in desperation, Peros begs me to help and pro give him protection from the faith. Pleading that I harbor him here in the castle. You'll be safe here. No, you must answer to the faith. I mean, Gerald doesn't care either way about the faith. But, the faith now we know has gotten stronger. They've been given more position. Ooh. Frank, interesting little mustache there. Um, not so sure how I feel about that. But yes, uh, carry on. Okay. Um, he's fallen foul. Perhaps begs me to help him. Yeah, I think we'll just get him to go. I I've got no position to him. Then war it is. So war has begun. The Torrentine and Prince's Pass. Fighting for my wife. My liege's council's discontent. I need a new septon. Well, there we go. <laughs> Another wicked one. We haven't got a good choice of septums, do we? But yeah, I think we're going to end this part here. Hope you guys will return for the next part. Can we win this war? Can we put my wife as the paramount of Dawn? Or will I die before we see it? Or will Dawn be able to fight us back? It's going to be a close one. We don't have that many men, really. But I'll see you guys in the next part.